Hi everyone, today I am taking you on a learning adventure to Shamrock Farms. Since we've been talking about different types of products and I took you on a tour of a grocery store and other farmers markets, I thought it would be interesting for you to learn about a dairy farm. It's in Arizona and you may have seen this famous cow on some of your milk at home. So let's begin. Shamrock Farms was founded in 1922 by a man named W.T. McClelland. In the beginning, Shamrock Farms only had 20 cows and they had one delivery truck to take glasses of milk to people's doorsteps. In 1933, milking machines were used in Arizona for the first time. So here's a photo of a milking machine used in Shamrock Farms today. Instead of farmers having to go milk each cow by hand, they use these little machines that are kind of like vacuums that pump out the milk from the cow so that the cows are more comfortable, it's more efficient, and the milk can go down these pumps into tubes and go to get processed. So it's more convenient for the business and it's more comfortable for the cows. In 1956, Shamrock Farms opened a new farm in Phoenix. This allowed Shamrock Farms to produce more products with milk, like sour cream and cottage cheese. So in 1967, they became the number one dairy farm in Arizona. So that means they really know what they're doing. Here's a picture of their barn in their Stanfield, Arizona farm. This farm was created in 2003 and is home to 10,000 cows. You could go take a tour of this farm. I've gone several times with my family when I was younger. It's really interesting to see firsthand where these cows live and where they make the milk that we see in our grocery stores. In 1994, Shamrock Farms decided they needed a mascot. And that's when Roxy the cow was created. She has been on milk bottles and different dairy packaging since 1994. In 2007, Shamrock Farms was the first organic milk company in Arizona. So their cows are not treated with hormones and that makes a better quality dairy farm. So here I have a photo of the milking area where these cows are all in their little, their little area and they are being attached underneath here, underneath these metal parts to those milking machines. So they get milked, the milk goes to be processed and the milk ends up in our grocery stores and in our homes. Shamrock Farms allows families to sign up for tours as well as schools can, that can take field trips over there. They're a local dairy farm, so maybe during one school break or vacation, you and your family could go check it out. And that is your dairy farm learning adventure for today.